Well, I waste no time. I came in through the door maybe five minutes ago and um, I, you know, why wait? I'm just gonna open this right, right away. <laughs> so, last Saturday, or this past Saturday, I made a bit of a haul video um, where I, I bought stuff at a 50% sale at a local store. And um, the selection on the, at the stores, they, I mean, it, it's it's okay, but they also have an online store. And on there, there's a lot of titles which are not in the, in the stores. And there was 50% off of every movie, every DVD and every Blu-ray on the web website as well. Uh, during the daytime, this was all only on Saturday, this offer of 50%. Um, during the day, the, the traffic of the website was, you know, really heavy, so you could, couldn't get on the website. And if you could, you, you couldn't do anything. So um, so they extended the, um, the length of the sale until 9 o'clock next morning instead of midnight. So they, they extended it 9 hours. So I managed to get on, um, you know, trouble-free or whatever, <laughs> after midnight. And I ordered some more stuff. Um, uh, these are those things. First of all, they include these in every purchase, with every purchase. Haribo, I don't know what, where those are from, but um, yeah. So some candy for free, you know. I'll take it. <laughs> oh, awesome. Alright, I'm gonna show this first. I made a... This is the title, by the way. <laughs> I made a... Uh, they also had 50% on the pre-orders, and I pre-ordered one title, but I didn't think that it would have time to arrive. I mean, it, I knew that it was going to be released very soon, but I did not think that they were was going to include it in the uh, that they were going to include it in this package. I thought that they would send it, send it later, but they did not. It's right here. It's before midnight, and I can't tell you how much I'm looking forward to watching this um, romantic dramas or whatever this is. I guess that's what it, what it is. Is usually not my thing, but the two first movies are, especially the first one is really good, and the second one is, is great as well. And I've been wanting to see this one for a long time, I've heard such great things, but the DVD has been pretty expensive on Amazon, and it doesn't go down in price. And I haven't been able to find a Region 2 Blu-ray until now. And this Blu-ray was less than the DVD would have been from Amazon, so this was a great deal. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to watching this a lot, so... Uh, if I'm watch I, may I might not watch it tonight. I mean, I'm gonna. I don't want to watch it right away just because I have it. I want to <laughs> watch it when I feel like it the most, if you know what I mean. Anyway, let's just see what else we have here. A movie which I think I've seen on I've seen on TV a long time ago. Um, White Man Can't Jump. Woody Harrelson. I don't think I knew who he was really back then. So always fun, more fun to watch a movie when you know the actor or actors or whatever. Wesley Snipes too. I don't remember this movie very well, but um, it sh should be fun to see again. And then we have this uh, Richard Pryor stand-up double pack, Here and Now, and Life on the Sunset Strip. Um, not a great-looking DVD with the two titles like that, and you know, looks kind of cheap. But that's fine because this was really cheap. This DVD. Uh, <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I mean, I I don't watch a lot, a lot of stand up, but I've I've heard great things about Richard Pryor's stand up, and I think that I I, I will enjoy it. So we we'll get two of them. I've, I've been meaning to get these separately, and they would have been the same price separately as this was for both of them. So that's a good deal. Um, and then we have another double pack here: <laughs> Get Shorty and Be Cool. Uh, I've not seen these movies, um, but. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I mean, I've been wanting to see them for so long. Um, and I got this for a much cheaper price than I would have been able to get this uh, double pack from Amazon if at, at least a new copy, unless it, the price has gone down. I mean, you never know. But um, yeah, I'm looking forward to these two movies. Um, especially love Dan Danny DeVito. And uh, Gene Hackman is in this, apparently. And uh, yeah, should be fun. Um... This said that it was used on on there, but it's not. It's sealed. So that's good. Um, 
it's a Swedish comedy show called Pappas Pingar, which would translate to Dad's Money, Daddy's Money, something like that. And uh, I I had never heard of this show before, but it's a pretty new show from 2012. And um, I love this actor, actor slash comedian. And uh, yeah, I just found this on the website on the, during the sale, and it looked funny, so I I went for it. <laughs> And uh, this one, it, it, I think this one also said that it was used. Maybe maybe they are used, they're, they're just sealed. Um, that's possible, I guess. But Time of the Gypsies. Love Underground, and I love Black Cat, White Cat. Or is it White Cat? No. Well, anyway. Uh, by Emu, Emu Custa, Costa Rica. And uh, I'm very happy that this got a release. It's from th This release is from 2013. So I'm really happy about that, and I've never seen the movie. I've heard really good things, and those other two movies, they're, yeah, hopefully, hopefully this is as good. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to this one a lot. I'm very, very happy to have this finally, because it was a hard, t it was difficult to find it uh, on Amazon. I mean, there's like a Korean release, I think, and then I don't know if it's released on DVD. I mean, I think it's pretty hard to find, so I'm glad that it's it's got a Scandinavian release or a Nordic release. Oh yeah, then we got a movie from my mom actually, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button. Uh, even though, well, I mean, it, it's kind of even though it's just my mom, it's kind of fun to surprise someone like this because she doesn't know that I bought this for her. The thing is, we were at the st uh, she joined me at the store uh, on Saturday with a 50% sale. And she uh, it had been her birthday, so she asked me to. Um, she got a couple titles, and she asked me, she asked me to look for this. If I found this, then this was one that she would want. And I didn't find it, and neither 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 did she. But of course, when I went online later, I found it. So I decided to to get it for her. So hopefully, she'll appreciate it. I've seen this myself in the movie theater, but not since then. But I remember that I liked it a lot. But, uh, you know, sometimes movies, they either grow, grow on you or it's the opposite. And I don't think I would enjoy this as much now, to be honest. But I think that I would, I think that I would like it. Pretty sure that I would like it. I mean, I remember the movie. But sometimes you just view certain scenes very differently when some years has passed by. Anyway, uh, this show I've been really wanting to see, Happy Endings. I actually ordered this along with three other... Um, shows one one of them being two and a half men season nine actually which i bought on the sale <laughs> so uh anyway i ordered this and yeah two and a half men and two other seasons from amazon a while back but the order was cancelled and i don't know why and i never placed the order again but now i'm happy to have this uh, i've heard really good things about this show and yeah it was it was not expensive so uh then we have the double, oh, what's the English title of this? The Double Life of Veronica? Veron yeah, something like that, but you have the orig original title here, I guess, so you can just search, search for that if you if you want to look it up. This is by Krzysztof Kislowski, and um, recently saw a short film about love by Kislowski, and I loved it. Loved it, haha. <laughs> That's not very funny. That's not clever. Uh, <laughs> and I, I've heard good things about this, and I like some of the Decalogue parts. I've only seen the first five, but anyway, uh, I like him as a director, even though I haven't seen all of it. But um, yeah, so this should be. I think this might have been used to. I'm not sure. It, it, I can't tell actually. It doesn't look used at all. So um, and then we got two more things here. My cousin Vinny. Uh, this is not sealed, so. Uh, this actually has a bit of a scratch on there, if you can see, right there. Um, but that's how it was when they uh, they removed these old older titles uh, from the my local store now. Before they used to have two three shelves with older movies, uh, and with older I just mean non new movies, movies that are older than just a couple years, because these days on in that store they pretty much only have new titles, and you know new TV shows, too. well not really, but mainly mainly new stuff, new, new, really, new really, <laughs> new, newly released, that's a tongue twister, um, movies and TV shows and box sets and everything. Um, but 
anyway, I was getting at something, and I think I was getting at the fact that these old movies, they were rarely sealed when they were on the shelves, so uh, sometimes they were a little scratched, and maybe, may, so maybe this, this is not used, maybe it's just unsealed, simply. <laughs> anyway, i uh, never seen the movie, of course I've heard how supposedly Marisa Tomei shouldn't have won the Oscar that she did win for this. Uh, actually, it says right here, Oscar winner, Best Supporting Actress Marisa Tomei. Uh, I heard that wh whoever called out the name uh, mistakenly said her name instead of who actually was supposed to win. And I don't know if there's any truth in that, but that's what I've heard <laughs> anyway. And uh, yeah, and it's, it's with Joe Pesci too, and um, that should be a lot of fun. Ralph Macchio. So, yeah, my cousin Vinny. And lastly, nothing too exciting because it's a Swedish title, but it's a uh, salt down, the salty island, <laughs> and this has all the seasons. And this show I've never been really that interested in until lately. And for this price, I definitely wanted to check it out. I actually have seen some of it on, um, on online. I was gonna say, but no, on TV when it was aired. Uh, but when I saw it, I'm pretty sure that. It was the first season, because it says right here, years 2005 to 2010, and I definitely didn't watch this show in 2010, it must have been 2005 or something like that, so most of this I've not seen, and uh, pretty sure it takes place at the archipelago, yeah, yeah, um, I think so, but uh, yeah, so a, lo a lot of act actors I recognize here, I didn't know all of these guys were in the show. Uh, like um, these three, I mean, I know uh, I know of them very well, but I didn't know that they were in this show. Anyway, so uh, yeah, I've I've gotten into Swedish drama a little bit more recently. Uh, earlier, it was only Swedish. I loved uh, I've enjoyed watching Swedish stuff for a long time, um, but only really comedy shows to begin with, and lately it last few years maybe maybe not even that much I've enjoyed watching uh, Swedish drama shows too and uh, this is a drama so yeah <laughs> okay that's everything for this time and um, I'm gonna make you a promise <laughs> or I'm gonna make myself a promise but I'm, I'm saying this on camera so that it's gonna be harder to um, to break <laughs> or easier to keep or well, whatever, but I'm not gonna buy anything else for a long time unless my comedy shows run out because I need some comedy shows <laughs> at all times. Uh, I just I just want to have the opportunity, whatever, or the, the choice to watch comedy if I feel like it. If I run out of them, of comes of sitcoms, then I'm gonna buy some more because that's just something that I I need to have at all at all times. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, so that's one thing or if I run into these insane sales again but in a way I hope that I won't <laughs> because of course I enjoy it but it's also frustrating <laughs> when I have so much stuff to watch already so uh, if if none of those things will happen I guess it's gonna be a long time until the next unboxing because I'm not gonna break it this time I'm saying it on camera this time uh, <laughs> so yeah I'm gonna watch what I have not everything uh, some stuff I bought and probably will not want to watch because I've lost interest to be honest but um, I'm gonna try to watch most of it before I buy more so there you go uh, with an exception of some comedy shows which is prob probably gonna happen actually uh, whenever I run out of the ones that I have I have a couple so anyway uh, that's it for this time and uh, of course there are gonna be updates with what I have so uh, and then there are gonna be yeah, there there are a few other videos coming up too with other th other things, but anyway, uh, yeah, that's it. So um, thank you for watching.